First of all, it's very great to be here and I want to offer a warm welcome to Minister Andrew Fraser, the Treasurer and Minister for Employment and Economic Development. This is now our big facility when it comes to A330 maintenance. It is a world-class facility. It's a facility that we've invested $85 million in to represent the best in Australian aviation expertise. And speaking of engineering expertise, for us another critical milestone today is to celebrate and introduce 21 new apprentices in a Qantas engineering department that will work here in the Brisbane workforce. This for us is a critical investment for our future. We now have 100 apprentices being employed this year and when most airlines around the world are reducing their numbers and scaling back, Qantas is investing in the future. A hundred new engineers is a big commitment to engineering roles in Australia and it is a big commitment in terms of an investment. It represents a $28 million investment in training engineering talent. This is critical investment in infrastructure, 85 million in this hangar, new infrastructure in terms of tooling, massive investment in terms of our people. This is key to our commitment to aviation going forward. Today is a day of pride and it is a day of good news. It's about building the skills of the future. It's about great jobs for today and tomorrow. And I'm proud to be here on behalf of Premier Anna Bly and the Queensland Government for a great Australian company, Qantas, and a particularly good day uh, for the 20 folk over my right shoulder. Uh, you know, people always have an interest in Qantas. It is the national carrier. It's got an amazing reputation, 90 years of operations, founded here, as we said, in Queensland. It is an iconic airline. It's great to see the mixture of new and experienced people in the company. Very proud of our investment in this apprenticeship program. 21 new apprentices here in Brisbane. It's great to show us Qantas' commitment to the future, to Queensland and to aviation engineering.